She is known as the princess of praise and worship. And after hearing just that little snippet of that hit song, mm. you can understand why, right? Joining us to talk about her brand new album, He Loves Me, is stellar award-winning gospel artist, Marette Brown Clark. It's Hi. great to have you here. Thank you so much. So when I hear, I just want to praise you, that is obviously um, an anthem for the black church. That was one of the first songs I learned playing yeah. uh, on an organ out there. Oh, nice. yeah, but yeah. let's talk about your new project <laughs> because this He Loves Me, it began with the intent of recording just one song. One song. Tell us about that. So, um, you know, that's kind of the thing now. You just kind of do a single and mm -hmm. you run around with that. Nobody makes albums anymore. We, These right? days, I know, right? So it started out as one song. It's like, I'll do that. I can handle that. And then I was like, well, since you're in the studio, go and record some of the songs you've done before. So that that you saw right there was the new version of I Just Want to Praise You. It's a song I sing 24-7, 365, everywhere I go. And so then you, you're in the creative process, right? Mm -hmm. You're a musician as mm -hmm. well. That is so cool to know. <laughs> you get in that process and then you're like, well, let me do this. Let me right. add this. And by the time I was done, I had eight full songs. And wow. I said, wait, that's a whole record. So then I was like, well, what do I do with it? You put it out. You let the world hear it and say hi to your baby. So this is... He loves me. And not a labor of love. It was a labor of joy this time. Wow. The freedom, the joy that I had recording this music um, was just really something I had not experienced in my years of doing this. That is so great to hear. And after listening to the album, you can hear that. All Yay. that you just said, you can hear that. It's a great one to check out for sure. You. you were here in Atlanta because uh, mm -hmm. you had a listening party that was I going did. on yesterday. How was it to, to see people hearing the new music <laughs> and how were they receiving it? It's so scary to be, <laughs> and plus, like I never see people's, um, I think God blinds me, right? Mm -hmm. I don't really see people's actions or what they're doing, what they're saying, but everybody around me goes, Oh my gosh, people were crying. They wow. were tapping their feet, they were smiling. And to mm -hmm. me, everybody looks bored <laughs> out of their minds. <laughs> but I'm grateful, yeah. especially with the, the songs that have been recorded before. I recorded a song that I did with Richard Smallwood called Angels. And actually, um, it was recorded here in yes. Atlanta. A huge deal for me and just my career just kind of catapulted me and what I do in ministry. And so to hear people hear the familiarness of the song and go, oh, they kind of like wax over like, I remember where I was when I heard that, yeah. What is so crazy about this song is this was 1996, live in Atlanta. Uh -huh. um, and what's interesting, too, this is the, the, the church, uh, House of Hope, Atlanta, yes, where Pastor yes. E. Dewey Smith is pastor yeah. there. This is where this was recorded. Mm -hmm. What, what does it mean to you even being back in the city when we know you were with uh, yeah. Richard Smallwood? You guys recorded this album yeah. here. Richard Smallwood being who he is, one of the greatest uh, in the gospel music uh, world. What does it mean to you just to be back in Atlanta knowing that there was so much that happened back in 96? So, you know, in the years uh, with my music ministry, I've been like Atlanta is like one of my places I come. You okay. come here, you go to church, you sing, you meet great people such mm -hmm. as yourself and you're like, oh, wow. all right. Life is good, you know, they've always been supportive of my ministry. But like you said, this time coming back, knowing that I'd re-recorded a song that literally was um, just so a, a blessing to yeah. my career and my life, it, it, I was crying kind of like bucket tears just uh -huh. with all of that knowledge. Probably, there. probably a lot more. Yeah, uh -huh, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. You know, that was, before, right? that was before kids. That yeah. was before, you know, now my kids are grown. It's just like, <laughs> I remember my frame of mind. That church mm -hmm. is huge. You it know? is, And I yep. looked out like, we're really recording here, we're, <laughs> we're doing this, you know, and it went on to do what it did. God blessed it, he breathed on it, and now he's breathing on it again. So I'm just really in a good place. Well, what are you hoping people gain and they hear when they listen to your album, He Loves Me? I hope that they know that no matter what, God loves them. I don't care what you did, where you've mm -hmm. been, what you said, what you touched, what you drank, like, I don't care what you have done. Yeah. God loves you. There's nothing that you can do that will ne necessitate him not loving you. And so we beat ourselves up a lot. We, you know, we're like, oh, I'm not good enough. I'm not smart mm -hmm. enough. I'm not cute enough. I'm not whatever that is. You don't need to do that. God loves you just the way you are. He's saying, come to him. 
bring your your stuff all and of let it. all of it <laughs> and let them fix you and just remember that that God is doing it because he loves you I love to hear that people yeah. you know be like I think he's mad at me I said no I don't know if he no. operates like that okay no, don't play no. games like that exactly he loves me by Rep Brown Clark so great to have you on the Thank show this so morning much. thanks for being with us this and um, yeah I'm glad you had a great time we I had did. a great time Thank having you, you here you know? <laughs> <laughs> be sure to check out the album he loves me it is out right now on all of the digital streaming platforms. Gravir, I'm telling you, it's one that you listen to in the car yes. and it blesses you in the morning for sure. So you know I'm